okay this problem is related to molecular weight determination so let us copy this one so this says insulin contains 3.4 percent of sulfur so insulin contains 3.4 percent of sulfur that is given to you calculate the minimum molecular weight of insulin so we have to calculate minimum molecular weight of insulin so this means I have one thing that is very clear that the molecular weight is minimum so we have to find minimum molecular weight so let us say if I have insulin and it contains 3.4 percent of sulfur so let us say insulin so molecular formula of insulin is something like this ins and then you have sulfur so this is insu and then sulfur so this is one part of the molecule this is another part of the molecule are you getting or not so whatever you have let us say x molecule of sulfur you have so what is the percentage of sulfur so percentage of sulfur in this compound you can write x into weight of sulfur divided by molecular weight of insulin and multiplied by 100 so this will give you percentage of sulfur in insulin so I have written in formula of insulin is insu as x something like you have there are many atoms all the atom is basically condensed into this form you can have carbon you can have hydrogen oxygen all is written in this condensed form so this bracket inside the bracket all atoms are there and sulfur I have written outside let us say x atom of sulfur we have so the percentage of sulfur can be found from this formula now question says it has only 3.4 percent of sulfur so I have to equate this with 3.4 percent so x into molecular weight so this is the molecular weight of sulfur so not simply weight so this is the molecular weight of sulfur and molecular weight of sulfur is 32 so this into 32 divided by molecular weight of insulin so let us write m multiplied by 100 this comes out to be you see here that is a 3.4 percent so this is 3.4 so if I solve for m I will have 3200x divided by 3.4 now molecular weight is function of x so let us say if I want to find the molecular weight minimum I can take x is equals to 1 this physically means at least insulin must contain one atom of sulfur are you getting or not insulin at least must contain one atom of sulfur so if it contains at least one of atom of sulfur so x is equals to 1 this practically means insulin contains at least one atom of sulfur are getting and now if I can find the value of m so m will be 3200x and x is 1 so basically I can put in the next line 3.4 so this is 3200 divided by 3.4 so if you divide yourself you will get the desired result so let me use so 3200 divided by 3.4 so this comes out to be 941.1 so this is around 941 so this is 941 gram per mole so this will be the minimum molecular weight of insulin you will have are you getting so around 941 gram per mole so what we have done in this problem so basically insulin can contain carbon let us say you have a atom of carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, I don't know exactly and it contains X atom of sulfur so what I have done is I have written this as insu like say condensed I have written this all form as insu form and then the whole compound can be written as insu SX and then I have simply used the percentage of sulfur so weight of sulfur is X into molecular weight of sulfur molecular weight of sulfur basically this is not molecular weight 
Now sulfur is the atom, so you can write atomic weight of sulfur divided by molecular weight of insulin. So from here you will get the molecular weight of insulin, minimum molecular weight of insulin. So let us discuss the next problem.